You are my hiding place. You will protect me from trouble and surround me with songs of deliverance. You will keep me from all harm and you will watch over my life. May your presence continue to be known in my life so that my soul may know that all things are possible with you and in your name. And your word gives me the assurance that you are a good God, a refuge in the time of trouble, and you care for all those who trust in you. And I declare that I place my trust in you, the God of the heavens, the God who neither sleeps nor slumbers. Your peace, which transcends all understanding, will guard our hearts and our minds, even as we believe for divine protection. Dear Heavenly Father, Although we are uncertain of what the days may bring, I declare your word. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. No weapon formed against us shall prosper as your children. No weapon from the enemy will destroy us because the God of the heavens is our deliverer. God, if you are for us, who can be against us? I ask Lord Jesus, protect us from all evil and keep our souls at peace. Guard our going out and our coming in. I pray for the one who is listening and I ask for your protection upon their life. I ask for your protection upon their families' lives, protection on their homes and on their finances. In you we find a hiding place. You will protect us from the troubles of this world. Heavenly Father, in your word, John 14 verse 27 says, Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Give me peace, Lord, even if there is chaos and trouble all around me. Let my heart not be afraid, for my God is a consuming fire. Let my heart not be worried, because greater is he who is in me than he who is in the world. I ask that you look over us. I ask that you watch over us. You are the Alpha and the Omega. There is none like you, Lord. We seek refuge in your presence. When life is turbulent, my soul will not be shaken. My soul will not be moved. Because my God is a way maker. Make a way, Lord Jesus, where there seems to be no way. In this situation that we face, we look to you as our deliverer, as our saviour. Be with us, God. You are the great shepherd. You will never leave us nor forsake us. Fight this battle for me, Lord. Fight this battle for my family. Lord, I pray that you let your peace soothe our hearts and our spirits today. I declare that there is peace in my life because I lay my burdens before you. I declare that there is peace in my life because I am safe in your hands, Lord Jesus. I praise you for your abundant mercy and grace that reigns over my entire life. I find peace in you, God, because when I am worn out, you are a God who renews my strength. Let your angels of peace go ahead of us when we go out and stay by our side when we return, because we need not worry about protection when we are covered by the blood of Jesus. Bring peace into my soul, a peace that surpasses all worldly understanding, and make me a light for others to see your strength. I come against anything that is not of God. I come against anxiety, worry, stress and fear. You have given me a spirit of power and of love and of a sound mind. I pray that your heavenly spirit will infiltrate my mind. I invite it into my home and into my heart. 
Your promise, God, is for peace that surpasses all human understanding. And I receive that promise. And I pray for the one who is listening in agreement. I pray for them to receive that peace which surpasses all understanding. Where there is heartbreak and devastation, I pray that your spirit moves to restore and give us peace. Make us whole again. Where there is fear and worry, I pray that your Holy Spirit moves and calms our hearts. When the heart feels heavy, Holy Spirit be our comfort. When my life appears to be broken, Lord Jesus, I trust in your word. I trust in you to make me whole and in your presence to restore me. Father, I pray that your light surrounds us. May your love cover us and may your power protect us. In your presence, I know there is safety. In whatever we do, Lord Jesus, as your children, wherever we go, order our steps, Lord. Go before us. Go before us in protection, Jesus. We bless your holy name. Although we are uncertain of what the days may bring, you, Lord Jesus, know our beginning and our end. And we trust that you will be a faithful God to deliver us when we call upon your name. You know what awaits us tomorrow. So I take comfort, Lord, because you are a loving God. I am seeking you right now because only in your presence is there a peace that can guard our minds and strengthen us. I lean not on my own understanding because you are an all-knowing God and so my trust is in you. I ask that you heal and remove everything that is causing stress, grief and sorrow in our lives. Dear God, when the storm seems endless and sometimes when my thoughts are out of control, I pray that you calm my spirit, ease my troubled heart whenever the enemy tries to steal my joy and let your peace rule in my life. I claim and declare your promises for blessings and peace and strength over my life. Only you can turn fear into faith, and my trust is in you, Lord Jesus, a stronghold in the day of trouble. I will stand on your word, your word that says a thousand may fall at my side, and ten thousand at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. And even if we are hard pressed on every side, we are not crushed. Even though we may be perplexed, we are not in despair. We may be persecuted, but we are not forsaken, struck down but not destroyed. Those are the promises of your word, and we stand on them today. Amen. <laughs>